Hello everyone, my name is Blissful Melissa and welcome back to All Hogwarts Legacy. Today we are going to be just cranking out those quests, but I think we're going to do... Oh, please lady, please. We're going to try and get some like main quest stuff out of the way. I, we got we to gotta have a balance between the two, you know? So we get to do astronomy class, which is new class. Is it's dragon. Adelaide. That's She's so exciting, cute too. I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Oh, I thought that was me, and I was like, wait a second, that's not what my face looks like. But that's my hairstyle. I was confused. Ladies, Professor Shah, astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. <gasps> Stop it. I love astronomy in real life and in game. Like, oh, I went to astronomy camp growing up as like a like middle schooler or high schooler. Still oh, you don't have your own. You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar. Here, I can adjust that for no, you. No, no, bring it into focus on your own. Come on, girl. Oh. I was like, what are, what are we trying to focus on? Wow. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside the uh, class. Yes, I can do that. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Leander. Leander didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very self-same stars above us. Is that clear? Yes. <sighs> Dismissed. We have gloves on. We're smart. <laughs> oh. Hello. I don't believe we've met officially. Hi. I'm Amit. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Yes. Hello, Amit. It's nice to meet you. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. Mm. I'll take it. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first rate optical enchantments. Mm. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, I thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some uh, reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Oh, are you going to ask for my hand in marriage? Are we getting married? Because I, too, live for astronomy. Oh, we'll talk to him. Oh, me thinks he knows everything. Arthur. Even told me he can speak gobbledygook. Sounded like gibberish to me. Wait, who's this chick with the same haircut? I had heard about these odd stone tables out in the Highlands. Perhaps that's what Professor Shaw was talking about. Should we talk about, about our tour friends? I'm not friends? sure what you can learn from these astronomy tables that you can't learn from a cup of tea leaves. Uh, Adelaide, shush. Professor Shaw is just about as cold and distant as the bloody stars he wants us to chart. <sighs> not how I wanted to spend my evening. The constellations are beautiful. You got I'm it, boy. I'm sure they're worth dying of a cold for, but they <laughs> are beautiful. They I'm are. Stargazing as long as I could. The night sky oh, is stunning. Looks practically brand new. Oh, I love <sighs> astronomy Pristine and the stars the and just... I live for that shit. Just like, oh, so magical. Oh, hello again. I have the That's telescope. Me. 
It's nicer than I had expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> but there is, um, something else. Yes? What is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. Oh. Uh... Of course, everyone wants and my help. You need someone to help you find it. I do. Are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than. Well, they are cowards. Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. Bet. I promise. Uh, bet. I'm excited. You need to convince me. Let's get going. Brilliant. You won't regret it. Shall we? We're going right now? I guess we're going right now. We're going on an astronomy adventure. The table is on a castle wall ahead. Are we gonna Look walk? for a stone platform. Something that doesn't quite belong. What's this? We'll know it when we see it. Onwards we go then. Yeah, run. Oh my gosh, are we gonna walk Blue there? Earth. Yeah, pick Some up the pace. The locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. I'm a busy gal. I got a lot of things to do. It is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Happy to be here. It is good to leave the classroom now and then. This guy. It's not that creepy out here at night, is it? The Gobstones Club are cowards. Here I am, charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? If you're sure. I'm like, lead the way where? I don't even know where I'm going. <laughs> Was that hmm. a little foreboding? A few cobwebs and some dust. All Nothing right. To be concerned about. Oh, of course. It's just not as uh, tight oh, as is I there expected. A... Caged bat. <laughs> uh. Oh, it was enchanted to chase after students. Imagine being chased by a bathtub. Imagine. Be some crazy shit. I don't want to talk to you yet. Incendio. More cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? Probably. Uh, no, not this close to the school, Emmett. Whoa. <gasps> should appear near the center of your view. I see it. Wait. Wait. But look at these stars. Okay. So as soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Should we zoom in more? It's taking some big brain thinking. Oh, Lyra? Or is it Lyra? I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. Well. I'll look forward Thank to it. We're supportive. Know. We're a supportive friend. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> this is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest. All, all right. beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. You're so kind. Sorry, I'm open. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. <laughs> it's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook. You know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. I am... Anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. So, you didn't want to ask for my name for my hand in marriage. Okay. 
<laughs> you say so. All right. We attended astronomy class. We need to go to divination class. Which is... Here, let's go. We're gonna attend all the classes today, apparently. <laughs> I hope you're all having a good day, though. It is currently Sunday when I'm recording this, and you'll see it on Tuesday. And it's very dreary outside. <laughs> very, very dreary, but that's okay. Kind of like in game how it's raining slightly. Except I wish it was running here. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to learn a new spell. Um, we still need to do the cabbages. How nice to which see honestly you, my friend. isn't life or death. Like, I'm not super sold on the whole cabbage dealio. We'll see. So we haven't had a class up here yet. We've been up here. So I talked about how crazy it would be to, like, go to class and have to climb up. We can't do divination at night. Oh, is there demi guys up here? Stop. Mind now, demi guys. Professor, under Professor Blake's direction, Black. Oh my gosh, it's in my honor as deputy headmistress to offer you the position of divination professor at Hogwarts School. We are thrilled at the prospect of having you join our distinguished staff or faculty. Please inform us of your intentions as soon as possible. We really wait your response. Warmest regards, Professor Matilda Weasley. All right, let's get our divination on. We went from astronomy to divination. But we have to fast forward time. Adelaide. Oh, I fucked up. <laughs> Sorry, I think I, I, I janked this up. <laughs> oh, I think I glitched in the system. My uncle's knowledge. He was willingly going to rot away in that cell to keep me safe. Glad to have helped. Oh, jeez. So I've seen him again with such relief. He told that they must remain vigilant from now on. I fucked this up. I, for one, can't help but look over my shoulder now whenever I leave the castle grounds. <laughs> Sorry about that. Tried to do too many things. Cool. I'm glad I only caused a bit of a of a tussle. Hey, why are we all trying to go up here? I Teach me. Those assignments I've completed all of my tasks, Professor. Teach Omer. me. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, oh. as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious. Based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come, what do you see in your own future? Uh, triumph, danger, power, I'm not sure. Mm. I don't know what I see. I don't know. I honestly don't know, Professor. <laughs> At times, the future is murky to us all. As with rippling water, one must wait for things to settle before the reflection becomes clear. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. 
At least somebody has faith in us. Do we get to learn Estelle? Thank you. That's all I'm here for. I'm here to learn the spells. Not that I think this one will be the most you have it. useful. Now, why not practice the new spell on the tree where Where am I gonna put it? Should I put the disillusionment charm here and do this here? Uh For a second I thought this was a student. What if I... Okay. What if I did this to it? And then we do this. At some point you must stop preparing and put your newly honed skills to the test outside of the classroom. Okay! Jeez! She just kicked me out. Alright. Well... Check mark that new spell out of the way. What else we got? We're like speed running quest right now. Um, okay. Let's see if we can get some other stuff before dark. We can do that. We're doing the moons. Okay, you know what? Let's get this kidnapped cabbage out of the way. Because I'm kind of tired of looking at it. If I'm being honest. And it's way out here. But good thing... We can just zip that zoop out there. Um, since the last episode, we've done a lot of Merlin trials. I did a shit ton of Merlin trials. I was just on call with my best friend and we just like chatted. And I just did Merlin trials. After Merlin trials. Because they pretty much all are the same. You know what I mean? Like there's some variations. There's like four or five variations between them. So it was pretty chill. I think I spent like an hour doing that. Also, let's save our game here. So this is Feldcroft. Yeah. Because we're getting ready to go into a fight. You know, it's always nice to just save your game. <laughs> All right. Because we didn't explore here much. Whoa, my game is not wanting to catch up. First I teach you how to think. Like, what do you sell? Hello, Mr. Ndai. Eddie Thistle is that would send Dung? You. Yes, he told me to expect you. Do you have the Chinese chomping cabbages? No. Yes? I have them right here. Oh. It doesn't appear that oh. you do. How unfortunate. I do think Eddie's idea has <laughs> merit. I knew I didn't have them. I'm not sure how many more attacks Felcroft can survive. I just want to see what you have. What do you have for sale? What do you sell? What are we in the market for today? <sighs> I have all these. I have access to all of those. A pleasure doing business with you. No, it's a pleasure doing business with you. Just sell some of these. You know, I think I already have something with increased ancient magic damage. I mean, one thing is that can have, like, low trait levels is lot three, maybe? Ooh. We have this scarf. This scarf. We don't want either scarf. Okay. Thanks, sir. Have I mentioned you're welcome to stop by any time? Oh, any time. Pavelio. 
Okay. We need to stay on task. Loot less, task more. What's this? Oh, it's just light. What's up here, though? <laughs> I'm a nosy Nancy. I can't go upstairs. Because there's a basket in the way. Ooh. Look at these cute little beds. So there's Quidditch. There's, there's Quidditch stuff here. What's this? Give me the gold and I'll be on my way. This is a cute little house though. The little trophies. This is really cute. Okay. Let's go <clears throat> fight some loyalists. Father. Wonder who lives here. Levius. Ooh, it's laggy right now. Sorry about that. Oh yeah, I missed that completely. What am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Ugh. Not my best. Okay, also, I'm supposed to deploy all of the food. The food. I'm supposed to use all three of these in one battle, I believe. <clears throat> For one of my quests. Excuse me. Uh, acquire all three combat plans and use them simultaneously. Okay. And we'll learn Flipendo. Okay, so we're gonna try and do that too in this fight. I can see why Feldcroft need. Ranrock's loyalists are hiding out near Feldcroft. They must have the other crate of China's jumping cabbages. Did I just see you him at once? Oh my gosh. Why is you so laggy right now? Hang on. Hang on, let's just... You know what? Oh my gosh. Just ancient magic the shit out of it. You? Okay, I need to slam with Descendo. Okay, so I gotta scroll quick. Leviosa. Descendo! Okay. Listen, I'm learning, bud. I'm learning. <laughs> Give me the grabbies. Ran Rock suspects there's more of it in Feldcroft. You not return until you found it. <clears throat> Ran Rock demands an update. Have you found a report back immediately? Ooh. Let's get this over with. I'm trying to get the hang of Stupefy. Oop, shit. It was a little too early. Ah, oh, shit, bro. 
I'm not on my dueling game right now. Oh, I have too many potions. My bad, my bad. Also, oh, Merlin trial? No, this is one of those ancient things I have to do. Ooh, there's spiders. So wait, did I get the chomping cabbages? Launch two enemies simultaneously with the pulso. You think? With cabbages. That's all of the crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. I'd better go and see Mr. Thistlewood's friend in Feldcroft. Woo woo. Good thing I was just like it's right like over right with. <laughs> Hello there. Do you have the special delivery for my dear? Hello again, Mr. It's Dine. me. Glad to I see have them back. Do you have the chomping cabbages? Yeah. I have them right here. Marvelous. This will go a long way towards protecting the hamlet from Ranrock's loyalists. The same foul curs who, I'm willing to guess, intercepted them in the first place. Along with Rookwood's lot. Feldcroft owes a debt of gratitude to you and Eddie. Thank you for your help. Yep, yep. Um, I'm lazy. You're welcome. <laughs> Happy to be of assistance. I hate dialogue. At last, some reinforcements. So if you're here for dialogue, this isn't it. You're here for random spell casting and shenanigans. This is the place for you. Oh, level two lock. Okay. The chomping cabbages. Mark that off the list. Got that quest done. Um. Let's go see Professor Garlic and then we'll do the high keep. Oh, Professor Garlic. I think my favorite professor because she is Chef's Kiss. <laughs> We love her. <laughs> we adore her. She's so cute. She's such a cutie. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of forgot about Natty for a hot second. Because, like, we've been spending so much time with Sebastian, you know? Meeting his, his family. Stuff like that. She. That poor our little, our little dueling partner, our little Hogsmead adventurer, Natty, has taken a little back seat. But that's all right. That's all right. We're we're moving at like a steady pace, doing side quests and main indeed, quests. Your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. You're cute, lady. You kind of annoy me, but like, keep it up. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. Hello. I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. It was hectic. I am forever <laughs> enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Aww. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Yes. Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. I'm ready. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing is mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. So wait, what's the Pendo do? Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so. Where do I put it? Uh, flips objects and enemies upwards and backwards. With a short cooldown, is excellent for setting up and extending juggles. 
It's wanting to flip objects instantly is useful for solving puzzles and exploiting certain enemies' weaknesses. Huh. Uh... I feel like that's a pretty useful one. Uh... We're just gonna set it here for now, because I don't know where else... I mean, technically, we don't have to have these on us, like, at all times. You know? So, like... Just as needed. I don't really know. Greenhouse, just mind the plants, please. We're gonna just blast it to pieces. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> cool. I think we got it. I just remember in like the PlayStation 2 Harry Potter games, Lapenda was like the basic spell that you cast. Like how in this you just have like basic cast. That was like the basic cast. So. It's nice to see it. Now, where is Natty taking me? Oh, my lord. Well, you know what? I'm glad we can just teleport there. Because I've already been here. Because I did the Merlin trial out here. Because lordy. Lordy, lordy. How do, you, how do they get out of here? Like, what are they doing? Like, when we're not in class, are they really just exploring all this terrain around them? What are you up to now? Meeting my friend at dark. Yeah, I was definitely out here. I mean, it's almost night. Should we just kind of run around and explore a little bit? Rebellion. Maybe? What's over there? Oh. Wait, we've already been here. Dude, I don't know if we had enough room though. We'll just we'll come here again and see what's up. Let me in. Girl, I almost died. Cause that's how we got to the Merlin trial. Lumos. Get out of here. Woo. Blood red fedora. Love it. That's what we came for. It's morning, is it? It's not afternoon, is it? I don't know what time of day it is. We'll just, we'll just wait it out. <laughs> it's fine. Hey, girl. Hey. Psst, over here, quietly. Why? Why are we whispering? That's right. I'm glad that you received my owl. We need to stay low and remain quiet. Natty, what's going on? Why are we all the way out here? As promised, I did some investigating to find out what Harlow is up to. I followed him to the Hulk's head. I noticed him reading a letter. All I could see was that it was signed by and bore the seal of Victor Rookwood. And after you told me that Rookwood and Harlow were after you, I decided that you were the perfect person to join me in taking them down. For good. Hello? That letter is the tangible proof that Officer Singer needs. It is why I followed Harlow here and why I wrote to you. I need your help to retrieve it. Wow. What are your reasons? You seem to be very determined in stopping Rookwood and Harlow. Why? I knew men like him in Uganda. I know how bad things can get if they are Bet. Stopped. Let's go, girl. It's their long story. When I promise to share when we have more time. For now, let's do what we came to do. Fuck it. Let's go. I'll help you find the letter, Natty. I'm glad to hear it. 
First, we must access the castle keep. I'll check the main gate, see if you can find another way in. I do not see any guards, but we should still try to be as quiet as possible. Hollow is here after all. Sure, I like. Be like this? Are we sneaking? Oh. As I literally knock over a vase. Like, I. She didn't just say to be quiet. Hmm. I wonder what that does. Well, that didn't work. Perhaps mm. something with a bit more force. I bet. That did it. Oh, jeez. Where am I trying to put it, though? Oh, I see. Okay, okay, okay. Oh my gosh. Is it stuck? Oh my gosh. Why, why stuck? Oh my lordy. Why get stuck? Go. Jeez. Now it looks like we got a Like, that is crazy that they just trust the magic. Oh my gosh, it's spun underneath me. To just, like, carry their weight as they, like, pulled up. Like, that's insane. Alright. I need to find a way into the gatehouse to open the gate for Natty. First, we gotta peek all the way around. This looks like something I can maybe set on... Well, I was gonna set it on fire, but like that works too. Can I not? Okay, it's blocked. So maybe dead end. Must be another way in. Yeah, but we gotta move it first. Big brain. That's why you always check all the way around. I like fake checked around. And you can't do spells when you're squatting down like that. That looks as if it might raise the gate. What's this? Can't believe I have to write this down, but you moon minds don't listen. Push the gate open, don't blast it. If I find it blown to pieces again, I swear it'll be the end of you lot. What do we use? The pulso? Should we go down first? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Do I just keep blasting it? To let her through? I understand what has to be done. Okay, okay. No, Accio this. No, lock on to this. Homegirl, I swear to God. When did I... When did I win Guardian Leviosa? No. Thank you. Well done. I will be right up. 
Thank you. <laughs> I knew you could do it. This way. I will get the door. Yeah, you get the door. Not like I know that spell or anything. It's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> that is the main keep. My guess is that we'll find Halo and the letter inside. We'll need to be careful once we get. <sighs> I hear them. Shouldn't we like use the disillusionment charm? <gasps> No. No. Hi, Wing. Do you know that hippogriff? Uh, yeah. Very well. No plan. I get the evidence and you free that hippogriff. But agreed. This is our chance. Go. Of course. Of course. Lost of course. It. There's got to be a, another way to get out to the roof. Oh. Of course. I really hope Natty stays out of trouble. Why can't we just use our broom to get to the roof? We're just recklessly running around at this point. Not the safest place to sneak into. What's up, bitches? Oh. I was I, I was spamming all the buttons. There's so much gold in here. Watch out, bro. I don't even care. Shit. Take that. Take that. That's what you get, bitches. Good, good, good. They have high wing. You know, it's professional animal rescuer or magical beast rescuer Bevelio. this is right up my alley of things that i need to do <sighs> i hope natty's having an easier time of it what we're doing great I don't even know what you're there's imagine if we could interact with a telescope isn't that where we came from yeah. <gasps> shit me you're going home in a wooden box Let me oh, 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 oh. I died. I fucking yeeted off the edge. Are we gonna have to start from the beginning? We're not gonna talk about. It. Uh, next time we're just gonna ancient magic. That person. <laughs> we're just gonna. 
I don't know why I'm like saving shit my neck, but like in that situation that was enemy an enemy I definitely should have used ancient magic on. It's not the safest place to sneak into. <laughs> Okay, so like this person didn't need to use it. It's fine. Okay. Sometimes I forget, but like, shit, I'm trying to use my fucking brush. Oh, that's not what I meant, but like, Again, not what I meant. I'm, I'm trying to hit Z, but I keep missing. <laughs> oh my lordy. I just wasted all of my ancient magic. All because I meant to hit C. Oh, that's frustrating. That's very frustrating. It's fine though. It's fine. We'll just be smarter. We'll just do better. Oh, I hope Natty's having an easier time of it. Like, we have plenty of healing potions. What if we... You're going oh. home in a wooden box! I literally just said bye bitches and just yeeted them off the edge. I mean, that's one way of doing it, right? It's literally just saying bye. I don't want to deal with you right now. That, that actually was pretty amazing. I got second. I got scared for a second. I was like, what if I get locked in there? I'm coming for the looty. Astrid, keep an eye on my stash, eh? Cheers to find mysteriously disappeared. That liar cheated us out of what was ours, so I took what I could and hid it here. Twenty damned years and treated no better than fools who've been here two blessed weeks. Manfred. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Okay, okay, okay. To the roof. High wing is all right. <gasps> there we go. There's another one. <gasps> there you are. They're chained down, though. Come on. A lot more. What, can two people not get on? Oh, lordy. Well, I guess High Wing has been through a lot. We did it. Oh 
Oh my gosh, we're flying. Whoa! <laughs> Fly slow and send the turn. Talk about flight speed. Woo! We're flying on a hip roof. Look That's at the train. Must be returning from an unscheduled run. Whoa. Okay, this is this is pretty legit. Imagine what it must be like to fly on something like this. Just to fly. Heck with flying on a broom. Like, that's insane. Sorry, my computer's laggy. I think it's just how it's gonna be. Fucking. Oh, our Harry Potter moment. Our Harry Potter moment of flying over the Black Lake. I wonder if anyone can see us from the castle. Wow. Okay, this is yeah, this is pretty legit. It's incredible, isn't it? Wow. Where are we going, anyways? Look at the sky! Look at that sky! Oh my gosh. This is stunning. That was stunning. It's the only way to describe it. Wow, so they're just beautiful creatures. <laughs> How exciting! <laughs> Oh, it was exhilarating, wasn't it? I wasn't sure we were going to make it out alive. <laughs> there was no need to worry. I had it all under control. Were you able to find the letter? Summoned it straight out of Harlow's hands. <laughs> I will say, I did not expect to see him cast the killing curse at us. He won't forget this. Be on your guard. Oh, yes. Yeah. What did the letter say? That Rook was looking for a fee. Oh? <laughs> Not sure where he will find one. But it also included Harlow's orders to inspect that castle for the poachers. Enough to connect Harlow to the crimes. I shall deliver the letter to Officer Singer. She'll have to do something when she sees it. Now, tell me, where did you meet these hippogriffs? I've only met Highwing before. Poppy introduced us. We love Poppy. Poppy Sweeting knows a hippogriff. <laughs> of course she does. Poppy will be relieved to know that Highwing's safe. I came to the right person for help. My mother will be worried. I must go. Seek me out soon. I shall have much to tell you. Bet. What, you're just gonna take that one? New item unlocked. Highwing. We can literally just ride around. <gasps> what? Beast inventory sucks. Stop it. Hang on. Listen, I'm here for the beasts. Go to the map chamber. Meet Natty in Lord Hogsfield. Talk to Deke. Hang on. High wing? What is that? Sepulchera? Thestral? Stop it. Caligo? I can put them in my... Stop. Hang on. This is the last part we're gonna do. We're going... Take me to my secret room. <laughs> we gotta go. I stop it. We can have more beasts in there. I have a toad that we need to add. Also, I need to remember that I can use like potions during fights and stuff. You don't just have to cast spells. Like I was never one good at like equipping items. I have learned of a wizard who is being harassed by Harlow. 
He may be able oh. to provide the evidence we need to take Harlow down. We should speak with him together. Meet me at his home. Okay. When you have a moment, please stop by the room of requirement. Deke tells me he has something to share with you. But Okay. I assume you have news regarding the goblin you mentioned. So much mail. Why don't we meet at the map chamber to discuss that and our next steps? Where are my children? Where are my where are my little cuties? Look at them. Oh, I can't. Where are my other kids at? Can I put the toad here? Oh, I have too many beasts. Stop. But I love my two. I love all of them. You're telling me my species limits reached? Rude. Rude. Okay, wait. Where, where is... Here we go. I feel bad this one doesn't have a name. I can't... I don't know what to name it yet. Don't I? Do I only have four? Do I? Where is my Niffler? Where my Niffler at? I'm looking. Can I summon it? Oh, it's over here. You just blended it over here, little baby. Little Daisy do. <laughs> They're so cute. I guess I could take one of my puff skeins and put it in the inventory if it means that I can like add another somebody else, right? Okay, let's Lila? I'm not going to hurt you. Well, my species limit is reached, so it doesn't matter. Okay, wait, how do I expand that then? Is that gonna be in collections? No. Is that gonna be. Where would I find that? This? No? Also, I need to upgrade one more thing. But like... How do I... How do, how do? We'll figure it out. I'm not too worried about it. But anyways, we're probably gonna wrap up this part here. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you all in the next part. Bye!